Hey, do you guys remember Lanto Griffin? One point Gryffindor! Yeah, that guy. Well, he literally did get one this week. Capturing his first PGA Tour victory. And if you need a reminder of where we were this week, our Houston Open locator comes courtesy of this good boy. The Astro spirit was everywhere. Josh Teeter got into it by rounding the tee marker bases. October baseball, fall golf, and Casey, I haven't heard the news from fashion bloggers everywhere. It's sweater weather. Swipe up to purchase Nick Watney's gangster style. These kids needed a parka over their sweaters for their high school state finals in Montana. Meanwhile, Ricky Fowler took to the beach to say I do Aww. to longtime girlfriend Allison Stokey. Here's some marriage advice, Ricky. Listen to your significant other. That's what Maverick McNeely did Sunday. He took girlfriend and LPGA Tour player Daniel King's advice not to look at leaderboards, keep strict mental scorecards, and say two good things after every shot. And guess what? He shot his lowest round on tour. We all know golf isn't always romantic, though. Sometimes we have to get our feet wet or put ourselves in a sandy situation before we pull off that shot that keeps us coming back. Once again, golf left us scratching our heads this week. Oh, come on, Wayne. That just defied the laws of physics. Can we phone a friend for that one? Get your coffee ready. We kick off the Asia Swing this week with the CJ Cup at Nine Bridges, followed by the Challenge Japan Skins on Monday. We'll have your live coverage and highlights, which means 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. Eastern time for all of you in the U.S. So I'll see you bright and early on Thursday with The Takeaway. Have a great week.